Your father's here. And you can ask your son, we were not expecting you to come home to eat dinner. Okay? I don't care if I had dinner with the cat. I was coming home to eat. I can cook dinner. But no, you do. Because you wouldn't have said it nasty like. Where's my dinner? Where's my dinner? Have fun. Yeah, go get your, go get rubbed off. Mom. As you always do. Mom, come on, Harry Potter, you're missing it. Yes. Mom, you're missing the Harry Potter. Yes. Come on, come on. Come home, start clap with me. Fucking asshole family. illegitimate Paul's illegitimate family whatever whatever that meant Come in the earth. Illegitimate cousin lives in, lives in the town. Well, I guess they should have fucking not messed with me then, huh? my house. I've been here since December 2002 and haven't stopped. Except for none of that bitches. There's that black bitch I could call or something else and I should. But I have friends that are black who might take an offensive. Huh. Isn't that right? That And that white litigant and that black attorney general did to me. All you assholes did to me in July of 2011. Because you're a bunch of scum of the earth. But that's alright. I know your fucking game and it's not going to work. No more. No more in this lifetime where you get away with what you said about me. Where's print that? Now, I'm trying to watch, do my homework and watch a movie. You're trying to distract me and piss me off. That's what they do. They come home, distract me from learning so I can shove it up their friggin' asses when I get in the courtroom. But that's right, they won't get me in the courtroom. And that's sorry, they know they're getting busted. It's only a matter of time. And they're gonna hang themselves. Who's that? Who's that? Yeah. Maria Saragoza works in the cafeteria department and they can all kiss my ass. There's an illegitimate wife, supposedly. And if that's the case, they've been poisoning my children for a long time and that day that Brandon had pizza on his birthday tasted like shit. She just never changed her name. Every Evans related to you? Who knows? It could be. It could be. 
Your sister's sick. No, you're sick. If you think you guys are going to get away with what you all did to me, I hope you all lose your jobs. And you know what? Half, uh, there's going to be an awful lot of single men out there who aren't going to play with their wives' games. And they're going to be single fathers because their wives are going to be in the prison cell for being stupid. Stupid asshole school. Hello? Hello. This is an important message from Franklin Township Public Schools. To hear the message, no. Have you heard the chirps around Main Road? The TTO is having a movie night Friday at 7 p.m. Bring all your chicks out to Main Road to watch Angry Birds outside on Friday night. See you there. Yeah, maybe. I don't think so. Not this month. Maybe one of these days me and my kids will come out. Hey, you know what? Tomorrow's... Tomorrow's Thursday! Oh, the doctor's gonna be on on Thursday. Thursday, you gonna press charges against me too, you dumb bitches from the doctor's office? I don't think so. You gonna hide behind my back, you dumb bitches? I don't think so. Because you can go down with them too. But like I said before, there's a lot of, there's going to be an awful lot of fa single fathers out there that's going to have to stop playing their jobs so they can take care of their children. You know why? Because they're not going to play along with their wives' little schemes that they're doing against me. And their wives are going to go to prison for it. And I'm going to make, I'm going to sit back and laugh at y'all. All them PTO girls who want to hurt me some more, you go right ahead. Nancy must have got friggin' nervous when I started talking to her about being a white, about these white collar scumbags in this damn town. And was pretending to talk to that one girl in the PTA and, and Kristen, uh, and, um, what's her name again? Oh, man, I just mentioned her name. Christina Ridgeway. I knew they were good, the games they were playing. Oh, she went around them. Oh, we got a restraining order against her, and she violated the restraining order. Well, obviously, I didn't receive the restraining order. Okay? To do it, because she's a criminal defense lawyer. Well, these guys must be doing something wrong. Oh, as, as Nancy Kennedy says to me. Oh, or uh, says, oh, there's an awful lot of people going to jail around here. This was back in when Brandon was in uh, first grade when I helped out with the, the PTA fun day. I wasn't allowed to do it that, uh, after that. I was only allowed to do it one time. And then they said, oh, well, we're not doing that no more. And it's only PTA members. Uh, and they're picking people to help. And... And all this other crap that they had excuses why I couldn't help out at fun day. But all these other asshole parents around here are there, aren't they? It ain't gonna fly. So my husband comes in the door, like I said, and says one word. And then the doctor's office says, when I was in the doctor, what are your triggers? I'm gonna show you a paper later. What are your triggers? They ask what your triggers are. Who's your supporter so they can take out the supporters and, any, and, and, and use every trigger they can against me? You go right ahead. You go right ahead. Look, there's my stupid snacks. If I cleared the snacks off here, it would be nice and clear. Oh, and then I was, my husband opened up his Wells Fargo crap. Then he was throwing it in the trash because he knows it pisses me off. So, Wells Fargo. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. Peace be with us, and the world's going to know the truth and how they mess with me. So I guess his father decided. Now, we weren't expecting. Now, Brandon, Brandon and I were talking. Little Brandon and I were saying that we didn't think Daddy was coming home right away. He was going out car shopping. But he decided to come home and start shit with me first. 